Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mark Armand. <laughs> I was, I was musing on how long it is since, since we last, last met, and it must be a good, it's over ten years. Was it really? Where about it? It's was Pebble it? Mill. Pebble Mill. And I remember yes, you Jean coming Pitney. on with Jean Pitney. Of course, the late Jean Pitney. Yeah. Very, very sad. Died this year. Yeah, but, and, and so young. But I mean, yeah. great, you're a good one for latching on to great songs. Well, you know, I have to say that the, the great version of I'm Happy Heart, actually, is, it's not Andy Williams, it's not my favourite, it's Petula Clark. Yeah. Her version of Happy Heart is, is what I base my version on. It's fantastic. And there's a campaign at the moment to make Petula Clark a dame. So I think, make Petula Clark a dame. Right, right yep. to this address. Absolutely. No, 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 right, right to 10 Downing Street. Petula Clark should I'm, be dame. I'm just looking Petula at those Clark. clips of me you were showing earlier. Whenever, whenever <laughs> well, you I see them, You could have been Dame Mark Armand with that hair, it's, actually. It's then. the kind of toga one, and, you know, <laughs> and everything. I'm really glad you didn't show the, the legs shots, you know, that was... We try and be kind. The pain, yes. though, as you realise, in working in television, is they have... Absolutely. Archive footage of you going back to absolutely year I've dot. seen them all. Yeah. <laughs> but we're very lucky to have you. I mean, it's not that long ago. It's 2004 now. You have this yeah. dreadful, dreadful motorcycle crash. Oh, I did. You know, it's been, a, it's, been a, it's been a difficult couple of years, a rough couple of years. But for this year, for the first time, I've started feeling better again, more myself. I've, I've had a new album out, Stardom Road, which, which got received really, really well. Like, that, that gave me a lift. Um, I've been on stage again doing, d doing concerts and things, so, and guest appearances and things. So I've really felt a lot better this year. Well, now, I was coming here this morning, and I was looking through the newspaper, and I was looking at the Times, and I saw that you were part of the Glam Rock tribute oh, yes. to Mark Bolan last That's night. Fantastic. Yeah, well, I got to the end of this, and it was an all right review, but then I came to the last <laughs> paragraph. It said, but it fell to Mark Armand, this is this morning's Times, to provide the evening's only genuine touch of star quality. Oh, that's fantastic. I haven't read that review, so thank oh, God it said something good. Very well. And it does say, which also I didn't know, that you changed the spelling of your name, Mark, into M A R C. After Mark Bowler. Yeah, I, I, I did, because, you know, cause the spelling of the Mark with a C was just a little more exotic and a little more interesting, you know, and it was also in, in, in tribute to, to Mark Bowler because he was such a huge part of my growing up and my adolescence and things. Yeah. That, and I never thought, when I bought my first T-Rex record, age 13, that I'd be on stage, um, how many years later, you know, X amount of years later, singing at, at a tribute to, to, to his life. Yeah. So there was a slight sadness about it, but also a slight, it was a huge sort of celebration of the night, everybody singing every T-Rex song, you forget how many fantastic songs that they had. Also, it's a good excuse to kind of put on the sequins and glitter. And <laughs> you don't get many excuses these days. But but, you know, go glam rock you're only old once, romantic. you know, so you, you've got to... You now, you sang last night with the father of Mark Boland's child, so tell us what you sang. Gloria, well, um, we, we sang um, Tainted Love for the first time ever in many, many years, well, for, ever, it'll probably never happen again. Gloria and I were on the same, the, orig the original singer of Tainted Love, mm. the reason why I sang the song in the first place, we were on stage together. And um, uh, Gloria's um, in, in, in a, I think she's in her seventies now, but she looks Gosh. fantastic, and she's absolutely. You brilliant. tend to think of her as being the same age as we remember him, don't you? That's the no, oddest no, thing. No, she's absolutely that. fantastic. Yeah. It was the first time that we ever would get together, I think, to, to be, mm. be on the stage, the same stage, doing this song. So it was a magical, magical yeah, yeah. moment. Yeah. It's wonderful where life goes, isn't it? From yeah. all those new romantic bits way, way back to so yeah, Gene album. Pitney cover versions, and now your entire album, this new album, is is cover versions, yeah. including. Happy heart. Well, I think that, you know, after the, the, the crash, I had intended to, to write an album of original songs. And I couldn't really focus on, on mm. writing at that time, but I knew it was important to get back in the studio and, you know, before it was, you know, I'd, I'd leave it too long. So I picked on some of the songs that are my favourite songs and made an album. It's almost kind of like a musical um, version, of, like, like a musical based on my life. Um, great songs with or 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 orchestrations and arrangements. And there's one new song at the end of the album, which kind of is a very optimistic song, which paints, the, which kind of points the way to the future of writing new songs again. And I have started writing new songs. So we're likely after this cover versions, well, after these cover versions, we're likely to get the original Mark Armand again. On the I next think album. so, but but I, I think definitely. But but I, I love singing, singing other people's songs, and I always have done because it's a tribute to to, to the artists yeah. that, that that were part of my growing up, and I think yeah. I try to choose songs that I can bring something of myself to, you know, yeah. as well. Well, bless you up. We're going to hear you a little later on singing Happy Heart. I've just got to say that, I, that I've got a, 
um, say, um, Martin Lewis's website. You've yes. got to go to it, because if I say that, he'll, he'll plug my concert at the Indigo 2 <laughs> on the 8th of December in London. So, <laughs> I think you just so, did. So I'm also, I'm, I'm, I'm also in Birmingham and, and Liverpool as well in November, so um, please come and see me. That's sure, I'm sure they will. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for the moment. Thank Mark you very Arman. much. Back in 1969, legendary crooner Andy Williams had enormous success with the song Happy Heart. Now, nearly 40 years on, it's set to be another huge hit on the album Stardom Road. All thanks to Mark Armand. <laughs> High Street's not